Hello everyone. In this tutorial, I will show you how to connect NetBeans to Microsoft Access Database. And this is also my first YouTube tutorial. Okay, so let's begin. First, we will create a new project. Uh, Java application. Click next. Just name this. Give any name. Say database connection. Oops. Okay, we will finish it and uncheck this. Finish. It will create a project for us. Here is it database connection. Uh, we will right click it and create a new JA frame form. You can name it if you want or else click finish. Okay, so firstly in this we will add two labels and a text box. Label 1, label 2 and two text boxes. Okay, uh, we will just name change the name. Hmm, where is the property window? I don't know where the property window has vanished. So just properties. So we will just change the name. Uh, give it username. Okay, and click close. Similarly to label two and say password and close this similarly for both the text fields just ok and give the column width of 10 and close it Okay, so we are done with two labels and text box. We will add one button for the button click event. Properties and let's say submit. Okay, and close and a label to display whether the connection has been established or not. So properties just move this. Okay and close so we will double, double click the submit button and it will open us the source code for it okay so this is the code and we will write the code over here for the button click event firstly we need to import the java package so we will import java dot sql package to create a database connection okay in this we will create a we will first get the string value from this text field and this text field so i will just create a string s1 and s2 s1 is equal to um, the id is i think j text field one dot get text okay and we are storing it in s1 similarly for s2 we will change it over here to 2 So uh, both the text field values are getting stored in S1 and S2. So now let's create a database connection. We will open our try block and followed by catch. Exception E and let's say system dot out dot print ln and we will display error in connection in this try block we will create a database connection say it will be first connection connection class 
and its object is equal to driver manager dot get connection and this in this string value url we need to pass a database connection of microsoft access so first we will create a microsoft access database connection so we will open microsoft access we will create a new database say test1 test123 i will i think test1 will be existing so we will create a test123 and it will create us a database named test123 so just right click it and open it in design view just give a table name say test123 only and click ok in this we need to specify the column name so say username and give this to text and this to password and this is also text and this is a by default primary key so we will just save this control s and if you open this there are no values ok so now we will close this now in this we need to specify the jdbc and firstly i am forgotten we need to import five libraries in this in order to get the database connection those five libraries we need to import is these commons lang commons logging hsqldb jackax and you can access so we need to import these five jar files so we will import it over here just right click libraries and say add jar folders ok so means i will select all these 5 jar folders and i will click open so i have imported over here the 5 libraries ok now i will need to provide a path of my microsoft access So here is my test123 database Here is test123 I will just copy this path Copy this path And I will paste it over here JDBC colon you can access and just paste the path over here so now this will create a connection to users admin document of test123 database now we need to create a statement statement and the object of it is equal to con dot create statement our statement is now created now we need to enter the details in the database so means on the button click i will take the username the two string values and i will store it in the database so means i will like create an st dot execute update for inserting the values and in this we need to specify a sql statement so means it will be insert into a table name that was test123 and we need to specify the values and the values are s1 and s2 which we are getting from the text field and here s1 and s2 
and just give it a variable that int a sorry int a is equal to st dot execute update and if when an ex, uh, SQL statement is executed it returns 1 so means if a is surely equal to 1 we will print a statement system dot out dot print ln record inserted or else in that label uh, if a is surely equal to 1 instead of printing in on the command prompt we will display in the label that was j label i guess g label 3 dot set text and we will say uh, record inserted or else we will display message saying it an error error in inserting we will just save this and run this project mm, we will enter the this fields xyz and on button click it will create a database connection to microsoft access and see we got a label over here record inserted just we'll go in microsoft access database open our database right click it and open we will see our details username xyz and password abc okay so we are done thanks for watching this tutorial thank you